it, it's interesting. How, how many of you have a turnover problem? Show of hands. Okay. Let, let me define a couple parameters for turnover. How many of you have a fairly stable sales organization? Not a whole lot of coming and no, not a whole lot of going. It's primarily the same folks from year to year. Show of hands. And hold the hands high and keep them up. Up high, up high so everybody can see them. Okay. And if you look around the room, the people that had their hands up, those are the people who absolutely have a turnover problem. Not enough turnover. And when you don't have enough turnover, you're inviting complacency. Basically, you've got an unwritten policy in your company that says, it doesn't really matter how you do, you're part of our family, and we will not make you go away. So you don't have to perform or overachieve to stay. You just have to be nice. So I, I believe that in order to keep complacency from showing its ugly face in your companies, you need to plan some turnover. At least, you know, and, and with smaller companies, this number doesn't work as well, but at least turn over the bottom 10 to 20% of the sales force every year. Now, the first year you do that, if you've got a sales force of 10 and you plan to turn over the bottom 10, you announce it, it's policy. The bottom 10% of the sales force will not be here next year. That means one person is going to be gone. And as soon as everybody knows that's the policy and you act on the policy, you'll never have a complacency problem ever, ever again. It's that simple to make complacency go away. 